Hello, my name is Sergey and welcome to CSCAR video tutorials. Today we continue to speak about the blocks in layouts. Previously we spoke about general settings of the blocks. Now I want to explain you how the individual blocks and individual layouts work. Let's roll. To demonstrate you the individual changes, first I need to make some general changes. As an example, I'm going to choose the categories tab. Okay, here we go. I decided to add a block here. Create new block, a simple HTML block. I'm going to use it for the SEO and content test. Create. Oh, okay, well, I think I need a wrapper for this, though I'm not sure. Some simple side box important. Okay, now let's take a look at the categories on the storefront. Okay, first let's go to the electronics. Test. Sports and outdoors. So, there won't be any tests because uh, we use completely different layout for this page. Apparel. Test. And music. Test. Okay, the changes have been applied. Now I want to delete the test text from the music page. I don't want to have it here. I don't need it. What do I do? Now I need to make changes on the individual layout page. For this we go to the products, categories, find the category we need, music, and edit it. Okay. Go to the layout. Yes, here the music has its own layout. We can't move box here, but we can change the options and activate, deactivate the box. Okay, this is the SEO we want to deactivate. And we just turn it off. Don't forget to save the changes. Now let's go back to the storefront. Okay, I'm gonna refresh the page. No SEO text. At the electronics, we have it. Movies and TV, we have it. And no SEO text at the music page. Okay, that's how we create individual pages, individual categories, anything you want. You can change any page by using this method. Now I want to add different banners for the different pages. Let me show you. Uh, because we can't add the box from the individual pages, we need to go back to the main layout page okay categories and here we add the banner add the block okay banners okay template original content add banners yes give certificate add banners create the gift certificate banner will be displayed at the all categories pages. I don't want this, I want the individual banners. So what I do is to go to the individual category layout and make changes. Okay, block options, content, delete. And here I add the holiday gift guide. Save. Then I go to the sports and outdoors. Oh no, <laughs> I forgot that we use uh, the different way out for this category. Okay, then I go to um, music and uh, way outs. Banners. Delete. Okay. Shop with ease. Add banners. Save. Okay. Oh, I forgot to move it. I'm speaking about the banner block. Okay. Done. First, electronics category. Yes. Here is a small holiday gift guide banner. 
Okay, we skip sports and outdoors. Apparel. Yes. Gift cards banner. Okay. Uh, movies as far as I remember. Gift cards and... Uh, yes. Music. Different banner. Ship for free. Shop with ease and so on. That's how you make your pages, uh, your categories, product pages, brands and all other pages look different. That's how you make them individual. That's it about the box for now. In the next videos we will continue to explore the features and functions of the layouts in CS card. Thanks for watching and see you in the next CS card video tutorials.